My experience teaching online during this time of um, the quarantine has been quite interesting. Um, as a former college student, I really feel very um, grateful for one and uh, very fortunate to have had the uh, the tools for this time when we needed to create the study guides and um, upload stuff into a platform to um, to teach virtually to our students. Um, I was able to do it with barely no problems. Um, I knew how the platform works. We are using Google Classroom with my school and I know how it works and uh, I have used it before because of college. And um, it was it was not totally simple because it's never a simple process, but but it was it was less complicated than most of my partners, um, my my fellow coworkers, the other teachers from the school. Um, they did some of them. They did struggle because they have never worked in a virtual environment before, and others that had worked there because somehow they study at a uh, university and they do homework online. They have never um, used, they have never created a classroom before to, te to teach online. So um, we had to work as a team. Fortunately, our bosses, uh, the principals and coordinators at our school, they did, um, they pushed us. They pushed us a lot to get things ready, to get things in order. They gave us tools. They they were sending us resources and uh, links to this side, to that side, and do this. You have these ideas, and for math you can do this. For science, look at the sides. So it was it was pretty much teamwork. That was very important, and um, we managed to build it in like two days, a day and a half. The first week because we uploaded some study guides for students to start using Google Classroom. Uh, the other good thing was that the um, computer technology teacher, she had already used Google Classroom, Classroom with some of the students. So they some of them were familiar with the environment. Um, but yeah, during that first week, it was really crazy. We were getting tons of emails um with questions and students that are not very independent um they were struggling to find the material and, and and uploading material but finally i think we got it we are now on week number three and um we are getting less and less questions they are uploading everything they know where to find the material they are commenting commenting in, in our posts and um, we have been we have been able to manage the platform better too, uh, to get the grades easier. And uh, it has been quite an experience. Um, we were talking about how teachers around the world are uniting to uh, to share information and to share some resources. And because fortunately, in our school, we have the opportunity to, I mean, the students have the technology to go and get online. Although we cannot make um, synchronic classes, classes and, and teaching because most of them, they have, some of them have, they are two brothers, two siblings or more sometimes, and they only have one computer at home. And even sometimes parents that are doing home uh, homework they are um, the office, uh, I mean, home office work. They uh, they need to use the computer too. So they have to share it. And we have we have been establishing a schedule for them. Um, but there is always a necessity to answer questions and emails um, during the night or in the weekends. But um, it's been a nice experience, I think. This is going to show everybody, every teacher to be more prepared to this type of situation.